Oh, jeez. Sorry. I was just trying to film them. And then I thought, well, I'll run up around this loop a little bit. But when I took off running, I sprayed them. Sorry. All right, I'm over at Hodge Park and I'm gonna try to do some hill repeats up and down, I think it's called Shoal Creek Parkway. It might just be called 100, whatever that road is. It always feels like a really big hill when I'm running up it. When I just pulled up it, I was like, it doesn't look like that big of a hill. But we are gonna measure this hill because I'm gonna run up and down it for an hour. And then at the end, we'll compare it to Og and it will be much less of a hill compared to Og. I just know I'm gonna set myself up for disappointment on this. That was a great run and uh, weather wasn't too bad. I think we're gonna get some snow tonight, but not as much as I'd like. I think only probably an inch or so. But uh, any snow is good snow, I guess. So may have to, tomorrow is just a strength day, but I may have to get out and play in the snow a little bit. And hopefully the snow will stick around because Saturday is a nice long run again. Thankfully, I already have an AUG comparison scale. And when we look at Shoal Creek in relation to AUG, it comes in at a point five, seven augs, so a little less than half of an aug. Not too bad, but kind of adorable. It's January 16th, Saturday at 6, 10 a.m. And uh, I'm the first one at Hodge Park. We had a great snow yesterday. I'm gonna get out and get a few miles before the sun comes up and, uh, and a few more after it uh, rises. parking lot's a little icy, um, but I hope the trails are uh, not as icy and slick. Maybe a shorter run. I'm thinking maybe I should take my coffee with me, but I'm going to start off without it. I'm never that far away from the car. I'm a little shocked there haven't been any bikes through here yet. Like this one set of footprints of the human variety. This section, fresh powder. I'm the first to be on it. Such a beautiful morning. I'm moving kind of slow, but uh, getting warmed up, and uh, these woods are lovely. All right, so it's 8.20, temperature's showing 30 degrees, but man, the trail is really thawing quickly. So I went ahead and got off of it. I was hoping to get more mileage on the trail before I had to switch to road, but uh, didn't make it. I only got about seven and a half miles in. And uh, so I think I'm gonna check the sidewalks up here on the road and uh, probably take a quick trip home. It's funny to me that I had to burp the bag even though I'm just taking it back because it's filled with milk and cheese. All right, so poutine night was a huge success. I made the most amazing fries I have ever had in my life. Sure, I soaked them three times and rinsed them off and fried them twice, but it was worth it because they were amazing. The gravy was fantastic, very flavorful. Pot roast could have been a little more tender, but it was quite flavorful. Cheese curds were good. Thankfully, thankfully, I bought two batches of cheese curds. So I got hy V brand and then I got Stone Ridge cheddar cheese cheese curds. And I bought these on Saturday, it's Monday. They've been in a sealed, sealed tight container the entire time until I opened them up ready to eat them. And there was mold inside there. 
I can't find any um, Best Buy date on this. So I'm going to try to take this back to Hy-Vee without my receipt. They're pretty good about this. I think I might also have to write an email to Stone Ridge. Such great customer care here. They apologize. All right, so I did email the cheese company. I haven't heard back from them. It's only been one business day. But if I ran a cheese company and a customer sent me a complaint about the fact that they got moldy cheese from me, I'd sure as heck respond within one day. But we'll give them some time and I'll stay honest. I've stuck just to the facts. The uh, tracking for my sunglasses says they have been delivered, but they are not up at the house in any way. So. I think it might be out here in the mailbox. Let's check and see. Oh, yep. <laughs> I think that's them. <laughs> oh, there's other mail too, I guess we should go ahead and get. Whoa. I couldn't pass up the deal of getting uh, three different types of styles of sunglasses. So, which ones do you like the best? I just finished some local hill repeats from my house. There's a little hill over here. I managed to romp it up and down at 16 times for a total of 991 feet of elevation. Ran up the hill every single time, and I'm pretty sure I was carried on the wings of Amanda Gorman and the hill we climb. And here, my dear friends, is to the hill we climb.